still some careful sneaky thought, but you also got to wail on those enemies. Oh, it's so delicious. It's, oh, it's so great. So, basic attacks here. These are just my weak yeah, attacks. Is this? this is my weak attacks, doing some weak attack combos here. It's kind of basic, you know, hand slap. I can also mix in a strong attack here, do a bigger one with some wolves show up. This here is a captain. So this is a re-dead knight. These guys are going to be stronger than just your standard uh, little little goblins there. He's going to try to use his classic attacks here where he freezes me. When that happens, he's actually weak. So if I let him do that, I can actually start throwing bombs at him and start hitting his weak point gauge. Once that goes down, I'll be able to do a bigger attack to him. It's tricky because I don't have the best item in this particular demo to hit him with. But I can still attack him pretty good. So there's actually a lot. This is one of many captains. In this right. level, we'll actually see some others. I'm going to go try to find some arrow fulls. Because those guys are a little more fun to fight than Red Dead at cool. the moment. Yeah, you know, and for you know, for people who maybe aren't as familiar with the Dynasty Warriors franchise, I mean, this is this is what it is. So this you're is really yeah. bringing you put now to, to be able to see that, have that opportunity to do so. Exactly. So now we have some That's different great. captains here. Right. They have a different thing that'll happen that'll that'll make their weak point happen. They'll actually spike into the ground with their sword. I'm waiting for that. Or I would if I bothered to wait. I don't want to. I want to go attack this keep right now because I'm impatient. I don't have to be patient in this, this game. This is the ultimate game for those of us who lack patience. Exactly. They're still going to follow me in here because that's just how it goes. But I'm going to try to take this keep. The whole point of taking keeps is to entrench your location, really solidify your control of the battlefield. So once I get in here, you'll notice a little gauge that right now says lower, uh, lower, lower level, level east. east. This, is, uh, this is the keep. So once that gauge goes down to nothing, the uh, the keep boss will appear. Once I take him out, then my my army will control this keep, which is the goal. So I'm gonna just keep attacking these guys. I can use these. I can use attack combos. Very simple controls. I'm making it look probably a lot simpler because I I know how to do a little dodging here, dodging there. I'm all about quick attacks. I, again, I'm not a patient player here, and I don't have to be. Well, and this is what was actually that that would probably be to your disadvantage if you were naturally. Kinda. I mean, there is there are characters that require you to do a bit more thought, but I mean, Midna here is frenetic. She's fast. You got to keep right. going. So now I've taken this keep, which is good, because now instead of spawning enemies, going to spawn my guys. Yeah. So I got to get to the next one. I got to get to the, I got to get to the upper level east next, because those are my goals right now. I can also stop by these outpost captains, but first, of course, no. the enemies are going to break the bridges, because why wouldn't they? Narrative twist. There you go. In the meantime, I got these outpost captains. If I break these guys down, these little outposts, instead of spawning bad guys, once again, the good guys are going to start showing up here. And, of course, I'm going to have arrow holes following me. That's okay, though. I got an item coming up that's going to help me take care of them as soon as I get done with this keep here. So I'm going to come in here. I'm going to use a big special attack. So once I get my, my yellow special attack meter up to max, I can pull out a bigger specialer attack. Hence, special attack. Did you say specialer? It's specialer than most. I mean, this is a pretty special attack, <laughs> but it's the most specialist of attacks. I can also huck bombs here. So this is one of the many Zelda items that you can use. Bomb's pretty basic. You get this in the first mission. You can see every, everyone's been playing out in the show floor. This is not on the show floor. This is exclusive content. This here. is yes. This is special Only place here. To see it right here. Only place to see this right here. Chris, you are up. That's the goal. Good work. I'm like this redead here. He. I, I, got, I wish I could break down his his meter, but as soon as I get the next item here. Okay, so the keep bosses appear, which is good because I want to get this keep. Because I know what's in this keep. And I want this because the bridges are down. How am I going to get through those bridges once the bridges are down? We'll see. We will see. So take it over. So I own this now. My mission is successful. I need to take these two sides on the east. That was very important to my position. Very important. So you see Impa off in the, on the horizon, but she, she got a little stuff. action going on here. I got a chest. I got to get a chest now. First, I'm going to get a little magic. Hopefully, I can fill my magic meter because I really want to show you my magic attack, but I didn't do that yet. So let's check what's in the chest. Who can guess? Quick, someone at home, guess what is in this chest, and you win. The knowledge that it's the hook shot is in this chest. Knowledge is the most important thing. It is really important. Of all things. That they, is a great prize. You in, just all, up. in all of the Dynasty Warriors franchise and Zelda Warriors franchise, knowledge is the greatest strength. My level is six. I'm actually level six of knowledge. That's good. Yeah. Thank you. We, if we're here to learn. We're here to experience not just great games, but learning. And we're going to learn how to take tick down this Twilight Dragon. Argorok. Argorok. So now that I have the hook shot, I have a much better defense and offense against 
all of these arrow foals that are flying around. Because now I can actually shoot myself to them, which is nice. The chaos in here is just like, it's just to the point of being maddening, and it keeps you at that level of, of like, just on the, the edge of excitement the entire time. Oh, yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let this guy go. I'm going to try, try to take down that dragon, because that's what I want to do that's right now. Most. That's what we got to do, because that's very important, because I can't let the allied base fall. If that falls, we lose. We don't want that. I can't lose. My boss specifically this. said, if I lose in this demo, if I let Midna fall, I, I pretty much let trouble. go. Yeah. I don't get to come home. This is this is no longer Treehouse Live. It's Treehouse Dead. I'll be gone. I'll be fired. Treehouse fired. We're using a hookshot now to navigate your way through. Yep. So right now, awesome. this base, I don't have to bother this base because this one is ours. We own this base. And my magic is full, which is great. I'm going to wait until my special is full so I can use this special tag that Zelda fans, Midna fans especially, are going to like. So I'm going to wait for that. I can actually increase my special meter. Now it's full. Okay. Now we're going to go over and we're going to go take... Wait for it. We're going to go take another base here. I can take this one. I'm going to... Okay, I'm going right. to take this base. So first I'm going to use my magic here. When I hit my magic, I'm stronger, I'm faster, I'm more resilient, which is great. But I don't want to use my magic. I want to use my magic and my special attack with magic. I'm going to actually use the Fuse Shadow. You're double dip in here. Do a downed attack here. Take care of some guys. Big attack at once. That. Just a little satisfying little tidbit there. Everyone's like, oh, we're going to do Midna Right. We're going to do Midna Right. We're going to do Midna Right. You can almost taste the epic. It's just delicious. And this is but one of the characters. We've already shown off that Link is there. We've right. already shown off you're going to be getting people with Zelda. And I'll, do Zelda, yeah. I'll do Zelda another time. I'll talk about her another day because she is a fun character to play as. Boy, I tell you what. All these characters are fun to play as. That's, the great, that's one of the biggest selling points I want to say is every character feels and plays uniquely. Mm -hmm. They have their own special signature weapon, signature style. So you really feel like Midna is going to play very different from Link. Right. Link is much faster. He's much more combo-based. Whereas Midna, you have to know what you're doing a little bit. You have to know just enough. You can't just go in and mash, mash, mash because she's got a lot of slowdown. You have to go in and plan accordingly. So right now, this mission... First, I need to take this base. That's that's important. And I actually took the base over by the Allied base. Right. That keep because otherwise that's going to be really deadly. Having a bunch of enemies constantly spawning and showing up at my base. I don't want that because if it falls again, I lose instantly. It's all about controlling the field. Just to keep boss, you ain't gonna last very long. Luckily, the keep bosses, it takes a while sometimes to get to them, and especially if the enemy's morale is high. Luckily, the enemy morale is normal, which is good. If it's high, enemies are going to be more difficult to defeat. And I don't think in this demo the morale is going to change much, mm. other than just my own personal morale is pretty high right now. I feel good. <laughs> I well, feel that, great. That's, that's, what's, that's, that's what's important here. That's what's important. You have to have good esteem. That's good. It's also important. I am at esteem level 6. I feel very confident in my abilities. Zelda's over here Here's fighting Zelda. this arrow full. And there we go. I'm gonna try to attack him. Okay, so that's 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 one way. I'm gonna, I'm gonna come in with a hook shot. Try to get him. Oh, he thinks he's got yep. me. I should be blocking, but I'm I'm just too I'm too impatient to block. Using the hook shot in battle, that's always one of my favorite things to do. It's great. Wait for him to get in the air and then I'm gonna try to pull him down. There we go. Now we're going to get him. Now we're going to get him. Okay, so this, once you get that weak point down, Smack. you're going to do a big old attack. Boom! Which is great. That's so satisfying, especially nice. when you spend a lot of time against a re-dead or an arrow pull or any other enemies. Okay, so now Zelda's no longer fighting that guy. So now she's clear. She, she's I need her. Up. She's good. I need her to get over here because she needs to make a magic circle. It's very imperative. Otherwise, that dragon is just going to keep flying around up there. You're right. So she's on the move now. She's good. She gets distracted very easily right now because she, too, 